when you're climbing the tree itself, what do you have to sort of be mindful of to, to not... Loose ones. The worst is loose ones. All the dead stubs that people leave behind. Like, if it's a homeowner, he'll trim it off and leave a stub this long that's still got a dozen good spikes on it because he didn't want to get his hand in there and yeah. do this business, see? Yeah. That's fair enough. But after 12 months, they're in a state where they fall off. So when the climb comes along, he'll flick his pole bell around. Next, you know, he's got his showered because one's let go and the other one could be just sitting on top of it. So now he's got all those... Spikes coming down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when I used to climb in years ago, I would have had pants, then I would have had a shirt, a jumper, and then overalls over the top before I even climbed in the tree. Now, the boys sort of laughed at what I said the other week, but I don't care. Like, if you're smart about this, you're going to get spikes in you. Yeah. They said, look, it's not going to do much. But if you've got a thick layer of padding there, yeah. it might just get to your skin, but you've just saved yourself from going to the doctors.